Hi guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new to my channel and you like my content, just leave me a like. Comment down below for your insights and suggestions and share and subscribe. I think that's it. And don't forget to hit the notification bell para updated kayo po sa aking mga future videos. But anyway, so I cooked earlier. I cooked some tuna Florentine pasta and so my channel is mostly going to be about me cooking, um, doing my hobby of cooking and mostly hitting the local supermarket to buy um, local goods and healthy choices for food because this is mostly going to be about my weight loss journey of losing 22 kilograms in 4 months and trying to maintain it anyway and today so i cooked tuna florentine pasta so it so this is it um so i used penne pasta it has red bell pepper some broccoli leaves because i didn't want to waste the stem and the leaves anyway so i cooked it too um i was planning to add spinach but then the place i usually buy in um they didn't have any delivery from baguio so today I'm gonna be eating this and even though I said I yeah I lost 22 kilograms in four months I still do my cheat meals every now and then so I don't feel so deprived or depressed over food because I love food anyway um, I'm gonna start eating now and hopefully you guys enjoy this <laughs> mukbang video um, it's gonna be my first time so um, Sorry if I make a mess of anything, but I'm just gonna enjoy my food anyway. So, mm. it's really good. Mm. It's creamy. I didn't add any cheese because I'm lactose intolerant, but I did add cream and milk because I still want it to be a little bit creamy. Um, and then. The vegetables even and out are even are evening out the the saltiness, but it's pretty okay. Mm. I'm really enjoying my meal right now. Um, yesterday I had some mm, what was it? Steamed broccoli and carrots with chicken steamed chicken so i was kind of looking forward to this day i know some people are gonna say that uh, this is probably i'm probably just gonna gain weight back like really fast because i'm doing this but i don't know this is my way of losing weight i mean i don't want to focus too much on just healthy foods i mean i want to take a break from it now and then so this is what I'm planning to do. I'll cook healthy foods when I can, and then when I'm craving for it, then I'll eat what I want. Mm. My tooth is somewhat hurting right now too, so I mean, even though it's hurting, I'm still enjoying it. And the total cost for everything and I still have pasta and the rest of the dish in the kitchen the total money I spent over this was almost 500 peso and it's probably gonna last me what like today tomorrow and probably Monday since I only eat once a day sometimes I mean I don't feel like eating too much so most of the time I'm practicing OMAD or one meal a day diet and then I don't know um, I think I've gotten used to it since I don't really feel that much hungry anymore I mean before um, I started keto around September when I started hitting my plateau I was stuck at 156 pounds for almost two or three weeks so I decided to research keto diet and then 
after a month, I stopped October 7. I became 145 from 156. So I was really, I was really ecstatic about it. I was really proud of myself. So I give myself a little credit now and then like this or like last week I ate my favorite at Wendy's like Frosty. Mm. I was planning to add more to my bowl but I don't want to go crazy today too much I mean this is already crazy for me but I don't want to go like way crazy eating and then going back to my old habits of binge eating uh, but anyway It's really hot today. Um, I went to the bank and then the bank was closed. And then I was hoping to get money from the ATM and then it's not working. And then the next available bank around was like three miles away. And it, I didn't want to like commute that far because it's really hot outside. So I just went to a local store and then um what was it? Uh pure gold. So nagpa cash out ako sa Gcash. And it's my first time cashing out Gcash. Not sure what I'm supposed to do, but I mean the people at Pure Gold they were really really helpful so managed to get my business in order in time anyway. Again, I apologize if I talk too much. I know it's supposed to be a mukbang, but I don't want to be weirded out that I'm just eating by myself in my room with a camera on. I mean, for me, it's weird because when I eat, I just pig out. Mm. You know what? This would tastes really good with probably mm, chicken I know it's tuna and then chicken but I really want some fried chicken right now or probably roasted chicken but maybe um, that'll be my thing for next week but yeah I'm planning to upload cooking videos or mukbang weekly so stay tuned Oh my god. I'm tired up guys. Like, oh yeah. Kinda miss my best friend. She's gonna be busy for two weeks or I think a week and a half preparing for her midterm exam. And we don't have a midterm exam right now exactly. I mean, we're just doing online classes somewhat boring but we really appreciate our teacher for uh, giving effort to teach us even though I we know like it's noticeably hard for him I mean it's hard for every teacher I guess for right now I mean especially for the students but I'm enjoying myself studying anyway Oh my god, not even halfway through and I'm getting full already. Um, by the way, I did eat enzymada earlier, so probably that's why I'm getting full already. But, you know, even though I'm getting full already, I mean, have you ever, have you guys ever felt that way that when you are getting full you still want to eat some more because it's so good I'm having that feeling right now hmm. 
my mom was actually suggesting that maybe for my next video I'll cook I should cook like hmm, like what was it oh um, Beagle Express and then I told her I don't eat Beagle Express I mean I love spicy food don't get me wrong I love spicy food it's just that I don't eat a lot of pork or food that has shrimp paste or alamang or baguong I just don't like the taste of it or even when they're cooking it I don't like the smell of it I mean no offense to everybody but I mean that's just my preference I mean most of my friends know that I love I love pasta I mean, I can do without burger, pizza, but I can't live without pasta. Oh, by the way, I eat rice once a week if people are going to be wondering. So since I ate pasta today, this counts as my rice for the week. And then for the rest of the week, I'm only eating mostly steamed food or hmm, mostly steamed food or salads with meals that I buy nearby, like the carinderia. Umibili lang ako ng mga like menudo, adobo, and sorry. And then yeah, by the way, um, yeah, I bought me a menu door adobo. I just pour it over my salad instead of relying too much on dressing, so it gives it flavor, and I don't know, it gets me by. Oh my god. Mm. Shut up. Sobra. I mean, you guys should try the recipe. I'll try to post it down below later. So check it out and then cook. And if you have time, follow me on Facebook. My Facebook page. I'll link it down below as well. And then, so if you have time, share me your recipes or how you change my recipe something that suits you right, yeah I was really hoping to cook it with spinach today but broccoli leaves, leaves but broccoli leaves are fine as well I've been wondering for quite a time what was missing and besides the chicken anyway um, soda I haven't had soda in like months already it's not that I'm craving for it I'm just thinking hmm it's gonna taste good with the pasta
Done! Bus na po. Hope you guys enjoyed my video. My first solo mukbang. But anyway, if you guys like my video, please leave me a thumbs up. Share this video on your social platform and make help me grow. And comment down below for your suggestions and thoughts. And subscribe, but don't forget to hit the notification bell so you're updated for my future videos. Bye!